autism return to a hand here there are four coins right that the next thing we have four broken cards here next thing i will be like this uh first of all these cards and then bend a little bit he put them uh uh, two third and fourth inside that the next thing we do is this way I will pick up the first broken card and the second broken card You can see the coin in this position, right? See clearly we only need to cover him like this in an instant The coin will run over this side of a very magical a magic effect may not be clear to see us to the right once again uh, These two broken cards right if a moment to tell you that the coin will run over you will feel very magical A magic effect may not be clear to see us too. Uh, these two broken cards right if a moment to tell you that the coin will run over You will feel very magical a magic effect Do bursaments of coins mean when they pass over you? It's a truly amazing experience we directly placed him in this specific position for the final time. Do not touch him over. It is truly magical when four coins synchronize and create an incredible effect. The instructions on how to achieve this enchanting phenomenon will be revealed without any delay. Stay tuned. Next we have to find four of the same broken card will look a little better. Uh, in fact, it does not matter. In any case, it's broken card on it. Uh, first, we first put the four coins, put him well, right? Try to distance a little bit, will be a little bit magical on the four broken cards. At this time, we try to bend the card, why should be bent, when we take the first card above to cover down. When the first one is actually no problem, the focus came to be the second, when I was... When I take the second card, I'll actually steal the coin. Steal it. Steal. How to steal out this way to steal. Hold him with two fingers and put him on top here. At this time, the coin will be covered this time. This is no problem. Then cover it up. Pay attention this time. It's crucial. This card contains two coins, whereas this card has no coins. Therefore, we are utilizing our resources differently this time. Right hand. Take a coin. A coin with a card. Take this up. This time, pay attention to... The coin is here. If you do an effect, look carefully. If you put it down and pick it up, it'll have an instant transfer effect. Right? It's very amazing. We can show the audience this card and at the same time bring the coin over here. Release the card to the side. Uh, at this point, we can do a cross transfer. We can say, look, the coin can also be put down like this. He'll come over again, right? We can even do it again. He can go over how to do so magical. He will instantly seem to cross the transfer of the effect. Ah, in fact, the coin is here, right? All right, cover him. Open the other. Ah, get him a little. Put this time again, this time over, this time again. Cover him. Right. Mm. Do the same with the last one and put it down, right? I know there's nothing in there, so do this. He'll disappear. He'll run away. And to remember just now, I also said, ah, uh, why the card to bend in addition to a little better? Take a little bit of the, because if the card is bent, then the coin is actually placed in it is not noticeable. But if you are a straight card in the put-up, when it will be obvious to feel the card with the coin and no coin, but if the bent it will be arching is not so obvious if you do not have the coin, when it will not be so obvious. Okay, let's once again show you a slow motion explanation of the four coins to one part. First, let's bend the thin card. Usually, my first, I do not take R, put good, his second will take here. Uh, the third, put down directly, put it right. We pick up this time to show the audience that this coin will go over in a moment next to him to transfer over, to take away, to open this thin card, to tell the audience in a moment this side to come over is also possible. How to come over is also no problem. Once again, you see very magical last, this one, to put him to the side to do a transfer after that. Go over and pick up the two thin cards and open them instantly. It's a very amazing four coins to one. Have you learned it yet? 